My brothers and sisters in Christ, as always, I hope this midweek message finds you and your families happy, healthy, holy, and wise. As you can tell, I'm not recording from the Co-Cathedral this week. You may have noticed I was missing in action on Sunday, uh, offer uh, a week of vacation in between Christmas season and Ash Wednesday. Uh, up in Colorado again this week, skiing at beautiful Winter Park, Colorado. I can't offer as many scenic views today in my filming, simply because it's a, a cold, it's about 11 degrees, zero degree wind chill, but more importantly with the snow and the clouds, visibility's not very far, so some of the scenic views aren't as good. But nonetheless, I'm up here, life continues on in Houston, and so just a couple things going on at the Coe Cathedral. First of all, excuse me, snow in my eye. Uh, this week, we've got the, the food distribution coming up on Saturday morning for those who are in need of food at 9 a.m. in the parking lot of the Cathedral Center. People can come through. There's no ID checks or anything. So 9 a.m. for fresh food distribution. The Knights of Columbus are doing their annual brisket sales for Super Bowl Sunday. So you can pick up if you order online on our website at sacredhearthouston.org. You can order a brisket or half brisket from the Knights. They'll be available for pickup on Sunday, February 12th, Super Bowl Sunday. Whew, as you can tell, I'm out of my breath, out of breath here from skiing. So also coming up next week, Thursday, February 2nd, is the Feast of the Presentation of the Lord. We'll have our normal daily masses plus a special 7 p.m. evening mass. And at each mass, we'll have the blessing of candles for the year. Bring a candle from home, or there will be the ability to buy candles in the narthex of the Coke Cathedral coming in. Then on Friday, February 3rd, we'll have our first Friday. Dr. Krista Miller will be offering the talk uh, in the Cathedral Center afterwards on sacred music. But it's also the Feast of St. Blaise, so we'll have the Blessing of Throats at the Daily Masses and the First Friday Mass at 6.30 p.m. My brothers and sisters, this is a little bit of bonus footage at the end. Sometimes people ask me on skiing, many of you ski and know these things. Some people who haven't skied, they hear terms like black diamond runs and don't know what that means. Well, this is the top of a black diamond run named Columbine. You can see the ominous nature of the run just by its name, but this is an example of a black run that I do once a year just to remind myself I can, while it also humbles me and reminds me that I'm a year older. So, just another little glimpse into the life on the slopes. So as to not end the update video on an ominous note at the top of Columbine, which I did manage to survive, uh, although it did indeed remind me that I'm a year older, uh, this is at the top of my last run uh, for, the, for the day. And even though it's still not great visibility from here, you can get a beautiful image of nature of the mountains of the valley around. And so, with the grandeur of God's creation, that seems like a much more fitting place to sign off. And so, as always, let's keep one another in prayer, and I look forward to seeing you all on Sunday. O sacred heart of Jesus, we place all our trust in you. Amen. Thank you.